natural mesh, mesh wreath using a jute version of red and green. So here are my two rolls that come in 21 inches um, in diameter and 10 yards each. But for this wreath, they probably only take about uh, two yards per color. How I would like to show you is by cutting it into six inch strips. Here I've used the green and I've cut at least six inches in diameter. And then I just simply stack them all up and I will cut them in half. So this is how I will be actually making the wreath by pinching two of those sections together. In other demonstrations, I've actually just folded it, but this one I'm going to cut and pinch so I have raw edges on both sides. So by taking that, I simply tuck, tuck it into the wreath, into the pine wreath, and twist. And then I do a little fluff, a little part, and that gives it a little bit of a volume to it. So I've done two sections in green just to give me a little bit more color and I'll open it up and I'll take my red and here I've added in some ribbon, That's natural burlap ribbon with some red and green holiday trim and berries and branches onto it and I thought it'd be nice texture. So I'm, in here I'm just going to add it into the wreath all at the same time and I will do the same technique by twisting and then separating the individual burlap. We'll add some more red and some more ribbon. Obviously the more pieces I add the fuller the wreath becomes. And you can vary your sizes. If you want a smaller looking wreath, you just make shorter clusters or even narrower ones. But this I find makes a nice size wreath for any door. Once you've completed adding all your layers in, just simply go around, make sure the pine is showing since it's a holiday looking wreath. I want to see more of the texture of the pine coming through. And here I have a little accent a bird feeder. It's also red and green. So I thought it'd be a nice accent. That could just be simply wired in. Top your wreath, adjust your pine, adjust your mesh to fill in, and there is our completed holiday red and green jute wreath. Thank you.